Okay, I just had to catch this on video. Right, what you're looking at is the head of a snapping turtle that is just like right next to my kayak. Me and Stacy and Tim have just been sitting here for over 10 minutes. <laughs> and I look to my left and I just notice that this fucking guy's head is literally less than 4 inches away from my arm. Which is crazy seeing as how this guy could bite my arm off. But here we go. This is the snapping turtle He's right here. Get you. He doesn't care that I'm here. Not a bit. Look, he thinks that he is such a badass, and he probably is, that it doesn't matter. He's like, I could bite this fool and make him bleed to death. He just doesn't want to give up his spot. Look at the spot he's got right here under this branch. Can you see the size of his back? He's not wedged. There's a gap between his back and the and the branch. He's not wedged. He's kicking it. If he was wedged, I'd fucking try to free him, and he'd probably bite my fucking hand off. But, uh, well, I would just lift the branch. He's, the only way you can get those, the only way that you can actually grab them, is by their back, uh, back, the very back of their shell. Should I put a stick by his mouth and see if he bites it? I kind of want, I, I honestly want to. I wanted to put my oar there, but I... I well, yeah, I don't want to lose my oar. I, I think it might actually bite my oar in half. Wow, he just made a noise. That is amazing. Oh, probably because my boat's drifting towards him. Wow, that's... Yeah, see, he just... He might take off in a minute. Yeah, see if you can get a stick. I think he's about to take off, though. He just dipped his head under, like, really quick. Yeah, I don't think they attack unless they have to. I'm not going to make him do it. He is making a noise that sounds a little bit like a growl. Wow, he's looking dead at me. It's scary to be in, a, in the presence of a turtle that can, like, hurt you. Like, I actually am fucking scared. A little bit, just a little bit nervous.